the rest of the two. The two caddy vests. We're going to be adding some more features to this vest. It's a, hand, a handyman, a handywoman's two caddy vest. Um, basically, just um, you just throw it on. Um, you got your little um, lightweight hand tools that that's going to make you more mobile and have everything right there when you're ready to use it. Use it. So I'm just standing by the diversity to the uh, two caddy vest. Okay, we have our uh, beige color design with the pockets here. And tight pockets on the side here. Real simple um, throw over two caddy vests here in the beige color or light brown. Pocket inside of pockets to handle your screwdriver, your small um, workable tools here. And we have the, um, the black design. This is what the back looks like to dissipate heat to release heat so th this is um, wearable when it's on hot climate so basically um, this was designed to release heat um, from the rear. I'm just trying to give you a close-up here by by hand the simple um, design. This is the front here pocket for um, large heavy-duty um, scissors we have a little workable um, tool on the side here, cutting blades, and our sort of screwdriver it's over here. You have a place here also um, to hang your sunglasses or your um, safety glasses. Um, your cell phone can go there. Some more straps on, on this end to um, make it very unusable. This is my um, two caddy vest design. My um, beige design here of the two caddy vests at the pockets to hold um, the sunglasses there, the safety glasses, the warm and uh, insert them there, and just hang them from the outside. So it's very handy. Or you can put your your cell phone in these pockets and. Um, it can, be, it can be designed with um, heavy duty pockets on the side to hold um, a lot of small hand tools. Same thing with my um, black design. This has a little bit more features on it. It has a lot of more straps on the outside than the, um, the beige vest, but um, they're pretty much the same thing. When you flip it over to the back, you have your um, have design here where your, your back can breathe um, when you're hot. Your um, air can get to your back. So this is my... Um, Rush for two, uh, two caddy vests. Then, by we're going to show you how to um, somewhat design it, not according to my um, actual design because it may be patent pending, but um, stand by the rush to the um, two caddy vest. We have the black design. There are many pockets to the left and to the right. Put your lightweight tools on both sides here black design. Two of Caddy Vest by Diversity 2. Diversity 2, this handyman's um, vest, I want to design, real, real simple design though. Basically um, two panel pieces, just like making a, a dress vest, my dress vest pattern. I'm right here. Pretty much take. I can almost. I I can take this dress vest pattern and design me a handyman's vest without being um, fancy. But um, I pretty much use the uh, same um, vest pattern that, that I would use to dry to design my suit vest. But I'm basically taking this vest and I'm uh, designing some detachable pockets. They got different tools that to come in different sizes. So I want to be able to design. Um, a vest that has detachable pockets and you can add the pocket according to the job that you're doing or the project that you're doing and working with. I want to I design a, a belt that's already attached to the vest to keep it from being loose in case you want some more um, everything to be snug when you move it around instead of um, the tools uh, flapping back and forth from at the bottom. So I would like to design a Velcro belt at the bottom here. And um, the rest of the vest is fine. Um, maybe some more pockets on top of pockets. 
just to make it more um, usable and more mobile. And um, but that's it. The uh, the grocery to um, the, the candy vest. So stand by. Go as we go. So it's not gonna put anything. I work handyman every now and then, so I know what's needed. It's kind of frustrating sometimes when you're working out to have certain tools right by your side when you're working. I kind of got my little pattern here. So um, I'm not going to use the uh, the fat, the material that the vessel made of. We're going to take another route and you can do the same thing with uh, blue jean material making the vest also. But I had a pattern that was cut out. Take a fold. You can make some a few changes here at the bottom. Basically taking that Taking the iron and folding and folding here. And just basically taking and folding this whole thing under. So I get that particular shape. Just it's not really a difficult shape to make. All I did was square off where it was round. to make this handyman vest out of blue jean. The material is not the problem. You can use any material. You can work with it. And the fun thing about the blue jean material, if you can salvage some of the pockets that make this particular handyman's um, vest unique, you can take and just cut out, let me see if I have examples here, the pockets that are already on the jeans. If you can take and use several different, if I have any more, looking around here. You can take the pockets, you want to make this um, particular handyman vest unique, and you can um, stack them on top of each other, um, two rows, three rows, um, for your tools also. That's, that's another idea I'm throwing at you. <clears throat> and, or you can take side of the jeans that were once pockets and you can use the pockets that are already there <clears throat> but some of this you may have to sew by hand unless you have a heavy duty machine to work with you want to basically get your folds in I got my pattern that I use for my Dress vest, I can use it also for my handyman vest. The, the main thing is getting my shoulders right and getting the rear of the vest correct. And it's easy to have um, to do. Now if you want to take and make this pocket smaller, I'm gonna show you with the iron, just take and fold, fold, and you're done. Iron it, sew it on, and place it. Let me slide this over so you can see. Up a little higher. About there. The tie. Let me reshape that. Just take your iron. Steam on it. And you basically, basically want to take and fold this. Now you heard of shade tree mechanic, it's really thick. So you may have to take your scissors and cut along here to get rid of that. That's gonna be an issue. When you try to fold, it's gonna make it even thicker. Unless you fold it past. Let's see here, we can do that. You don't wanna cut off too much, you're gonna mess up, but you can get that flat and work with it, you can get it on there. 
on it. You can fold it and get rid of it. Okay, here we have this can be the bottom pocket. So all 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 left to do now, you got your two pockets, or your three or four pockets on this um, caddy tool caddy vest. This is the blue jean style. So make sure that your tools are gonna go where they need to go. There's plenty of room here. Put your small hand tool, your screwdrivers, your leveler, your pens, your pencils, your scissors. Cutters. Make sure the blade is placing the other one. So pretty much um that's it. This tool cat is pretty simple to make. Um you can design it with you, you have old clothes, you can make your own tool caddy. This is very it's gonna be very unique one. This, this, this one's gonna be popular. I think the blue jean. Once you get all that done, take your needles, your thread, everything you need, your heavy doodle, heavy doodle, he heavy duty <laughs> needles and thread, and I'll just go to work and I'll.